All right, what's up, guys? Um, I know I haven't made a video in a while, but uh, I just wanted to share this real quick. So we're gonna take any Android phone, this is an LG V20, and we are going to completely transform it and make it look exactly like the Pixel 2 and Pixel 2 XL. You can watch MKBHD's uh, Pixel 2 impressions uh, just to see the, the look that I was going for here. So the first thing you're gonna need, a um, couple things. This isn't gonna be technically free. I guess you could do it for free if, uh, if you want but I'm not going to be providing any of these apps for free. So you're gonna need Nova Launcher Prime and you're gonna need Zuper Widgets Pro. Um, those are the only two things um, that you're absolutely gonna need to pull this look off. So the first thing we're gonna do is switch to uh, Nova Launcher Prime. So here, you can see now we have um, Nova Launcher. This is our Nova Nova Launcher is going to be our default home screen now. So the next thing we need to do is add the the Google search bar down here at the bottom. So we're going to go into our widgets and then we want to select the Nova Quick Search bar and add that to the home screen. And then resize it so that it takes up the whole screen. And then we want to move it down here to the bottom. Now, you also want it to swipe up to open up the uh, app drawer. So you have to go into your Nova settings. And we're going to do two things here. App and widget draw. We are going to turn on swipe to open. And you swipe to open and if you want to uh, have the indicator there uh, the swipe indicator you can I like it with the swipe indicator you might not you can turn that off if you don't want that on and then we also want to go into gestures and inputs this will just make the swipe to open the app drawer work a little bit better and then change swipe up to activate your app draw then we go back to the home screen so you can see where we um, you know, we pretty much have the look, but we need a new wallpaper and we need um, a couple widgets that I made in Super Widget Pro. And then an optional addition to this, uh, you can see if I swipe, swipe from the left to the right, it opens up Google. I'm going to put a link in the description of this video where you can get the... Uh, Nova Launcher Google Companion. So you just install that, run it once, and then it adds this swipe with the matching animation to open up your uh, your Google feed there when you swipe left on the home screen. It's a nice little touch. Um, so then you're gonna want to add a new widget, a Zuper widget, one by one. resize this to about that size there now you're gonna to want to download the two super widgets that I link in the description and then you want to move those with a file manager into your super widgets template folder so if you go into uh, file manager and then I'm in the internal storage you want to find the Zuper widget folder and then there's a templates folder I have a ton of templates in here for uh, widgets that I've made you just want to take the two ZW files that I put in the description and throw those in that folder and then they will show up when you uh, tap on this you want to choose your SD card and then it just takes a second but it's gonna load uh, all of the Zuper widgets that you have in that template folder will load up and once they do you want to scroll until you find the two widgets that I've given you. Uh, so, I actually have three of them here. Pixel 2 V3 with the calendar working is the one that's in the description. And Pixel 2 V1. So this is basically just the 
the really basic um, day and date of the month plus a, a weather widget there on the side pretty basic but that if you watch um, anybody that did a video on the the launch of the Pixel 2 and first impressions and everything that was the uh, the default widget and then we also have this other one and this took me hours and hours of trying to get this widget to work exactly like it worked at the, the Pixel 2 launch so I'm gonna load this up sorry I have a ton of widgets so if we open this up and then you can see it basically takes the next um, calendar event and it tells you when that event occurs tomorrow uh, it, it can it can show you um, so if the if the appointment is today it will tell you in hours if it's within an hour it will change to minutes if it's tomorrow it will say tomorrow and then anything past tomorrow it will say in two days in three days in four days etc so it works exactly like the pixel 2 widget and then when the the time that this is that this is set up for so the time that this appointment um, occurs at it will say the the appointment and then in parentheses now so you know that it, you're, you're currently in that appointment so the one last thing that we have to do is uh, change the wallpaper to um, a Google default wallpaper so uh, I don't think I have there are a couple default uh, Pixel 2 wallpapers that are out, but I actually like this one. This is an Android Oreo default wallpaper. So we're going to set this as our Nova, Nova Launcher uh, wallpaper. Just I'll, I'll link this image in the description. And then there we go. Now we have basically an exact one-for-one -one replica of the Pixel 2 with the calendar and the um, calendar widget and the default um, simple time widget and it has the search bar at the bottom swipe up for apps oh one last thing when you when you set this widget uh, you have to go into your Nova settings Oh, whoops so you want to go into your Nova settings and I'm gonna go to desktop um, so you want to go into search bar style and then right here where it says bar color that is the hex code right there and you want to set that as the search bar color and you also want to use that same color on your app and widget draw your background color for that is going to be the same I actually think it's slightly different I don't know it might be the same I can't remember but those are the two hex codes for the colors for the, the app draw and for for the app draw and for the Google search bar and that's that. That's how you transform any Android phone and make it look exactly like a Google Pixel 2. That's it for today, guys. Uh, I'm going to try to get a little bit more active on this channel. I know I've been, I've been dormant for quite a while now. Work's been crazy. Life's been crazy. Everything's just been hectic. But uh, if you use these widgets and you post screenshots anywhere, please give me credit. Uh, just, just so you can see this took me hours that is the Zuper widgets formula to get that text to display correctly it took me hours to get that so that it works perfectly and displays the correct data there all the time 
So I've seen some other people where it just shows the name of the uh, the next event and the time that it's going to occur at. This one actually acts exactly like the Pixel 2 widget where it gives you the minutes, hours, or days uh, until your next appointment. So let me see if I if I add um, if I add a calendar event real All right, quick. So as you can see. Uh, I just added that test event to my calendar and now it reports in minutes instead of saying tomorrow just like the uh, the default widget on the Pixel 2 as shown off at the uh, at the release event. So that's going to do it guys. If you like this video please like it, share it all over social media, follow me on Twitter, uh, all that good stuff and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.